Hey you guys, good morning, good morning, good morning. Rise and grind, rise and grind. Guess what? We not talk about bad for the body work, but we got some finery at Target time. All right. We got some new ski to chit chat about, and I am super excited for it. All right. So first things first, we are on Instagram, and you guys need to follow if you don't already, Sense Galore, because it's her pictures and info that we are using on today. I'm just bringing it to you. So I'm super, super excited about the news that she drops, and she always talks about the new ski that's out. Just check her page on Instagram, and I don't know if she's on any other platform, but that's the girl. All right, so we're going to get into the new news. So there are three new fragrance mist, which I've actually heard, though, after chit-chatting with the girls. You already know that it's actually four of them that are supposed to be coming out here soon. They're supposed to be, or they're scheduled to come out on the 18th. But as you see here in these pictures, somebody already got them, sis. They, they already got it in the store. Listen, it must be nice. It must be nice. I went to my store and went Squididdly Squat. Okay, Squididdly Squat was there, all right? No finery of the new ski, all right? Just the old stuff. So, the three fragrances we have are Pistachio Please. We have Without a Trace. And then we also have the new Rouge. Now, I think the other one is called, let me check real quick. All right, so the other one that's missing is called Dress to Impress, but I haven't seen any pictures of her anywhere. So I might do a little Google search before I post this and see if I can find a picture so we can talk about that one too. But there's supposed to be four new fragrances from Finery. And let's get into the details of these things. Let's zoom up as good as we can zoom. All right, so with pistachio, please, I'm actually looking forward to smelling this one. All right, I, I wanna wrap my nose all around and about it. Now it says the scent experience it's a guilty pleasure. <laughs> and I'm here for it. Let's go ahead. So what it smell like? It says it has notes of pistachio milk, fluffy vanilla, and tonka bean. Listen, it smells like a gourmand lover's dream. Okay? That's what it smells like. Now, I'm not going to say gourmand too. You know, I'm going to whisper gourmand very softly because it could just be a nice, sweet vanilla smell. Um, but I'm looking forward to it being a little more. All right, so that one is pistachio, please. A guilty pleasure. So the next one we have here is Without a Trace. Now listen, I don't like the name of this, Without a Trace. Like, it sound cute, but it make me wonder, is it going to stick to my body or is it going to melt away quickly? You know, you got to be a little careful with the names that you be giving stuff. Because Without a Trace, if I spray it and after 10 minutes I don't smell, I'm going to be like, listen, you stood up to your name. Absolutely. You lived up to it. All right. Whatever the case, though, the scent experience is the lasting feeling of your touch. It's giving skin scent. <laughs> all, the, all the context clues here, Without a Trace. The lasting feeling of your touch. It's giving. This is just going to be close to my skin. Only my man will be able to smell it. But listen. We're going to smell it first. But but it, I'm getting that. I'm getting that. Am I the only one? I feel like I'm getting it. So what it smell like? The notes in this are Neroli Blossom. Which is my girl. Listen. I love me a good Neroli Blossom. Okay. Cedarwood and Suede Musk. Now this could possibly be like a unisex scent. I feel like. I feel like it's not going to be too feminine, but it's also not going to be too masculine. Um, it's the lasting feeling of your touch. So <laughs> that is without a trace. And then the last one we have is the new Rouge. Up, oh, hold on. We weren't ready to go to that clip yet. It skipped on over to the next thing we're going to talk about. But it's the new Rouge. And it says the sin experience is an opulent, lavish fantasy. Okay, opulent. Okay, I'm here for it. What you got? I'm wearing something opulent today. Lavish and fantasy. What it smell like? So the notes in this are golden saffron, amber risen, and sandalwood. Listen, I feel like these two are going to be a unisex scent. So it could either be super masculine on you or it could be super feminine. All right, so one thing we love about Finery is the price point. So it looks like they're going to have the concentrated perfume and they're also going to have the body mist. Now, the body mist are $14.99. Hopefully, they don't do any inflation or anything like that. So it is definitely affordability at its finest. And I want to say the fragrance mist is, or the fine fragrance is normally like $29.99. Let me check. Yeah, I'm on a website. So 
typically the fine fragrance is $29.99 if you want to get it. So still very affordable. And they be having sales going on. Listen, spend $25, get $5 off. By the time this is up on the website, I hope that the sale is still selling. Okay? Because we want we want a little extra. We want to get fired. We do. So that is the new finery that's coming out. But there is something else coming out as well. And that is two new fragrances from Mix Bar. Now, I have personally never bought any Mix Bar perfumes, but I have heard really good things about them. I've just always liked finery the most, especially my cherry. I know I stocked up on that girl. Um, but they do have two coming out. And the first one is Salt Petals. That doesn't sound appetizing to me. <laughs> It just don't and then the other one is passion fruit nectar now that one would be one that i picked up um but these are supposed to be coming out here soon i want to say it's the 18th as well and they might be at your store already because they're already at this girl's store so that is the new ski that's going on with finery like i said it's supposed to be one more but i looked i google searched everything and could not find it or find any notes for it but yeah i just wanted to bring this to you guys attention so you can put it on your radar you can get ready to look around your target because the girl is gonna buy it out the first time it drops i promise you it's gonna be gone as soon as these new ones drop they're gonna be gone for a little bit but they always bring it back so if you do miss out on it coming out on the 18th, um, just know that they do restock and they do a fairly good job at restocking quickly, just like they did with our Not Another Cherry. So just stock the website, stock your store, and hopefully you should get them. I'm really looking, ex I'm looking excited. Yeah, I'm excited, <laughs> but I'm really looking forward to getting my nose around these, especially pistachio. So that's today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you are new here, don't forget to subscribe. Ring that bell so you're notified every time I post a video. Give your girl a big thumbs up and let me know in the comment section. Are you buying it? Okay? Are you buying it? Or are you passing? Or which one sounds like your favorite? Have you found them in your store already? Let me know. Thank you so much for watching. And you already know, girl. I will see you later. Bye, girl. <laughs>